Hey there guys, it's me, Eve 6 here, back with another video, and today I'm going to show you how to download Windows 10 on a USB flash drive so you can install it on a computer. So, first of all, all you want to do is go to Firefox or your preference browser, type in Windows, got that wrong, Windows Media Creation Tool. Once you've done that, all you need to do is se select it says download Windows 10 disk image with brackets ISO file and it says that it's off. If there's any others, then it's wrong. Just click on that one and just hit download tool now. You'll get popped up to this. It's say media creation tool. If it doesn't say 1909, don't worry about it. They've released a new version, so it might be 2004, for example. That's the next version that's on its way out. So all you want to do is hit save file. I've already got this downloaded because I to take the video but I forgot to record it so yeah so yes save file and then once it's downloaded all you have to do is hit one or if not go to downloads and double click it now it come up you can't see the screen but it came with a user account control it says do you want to allow this app to make changes to your device all you have to do is hit yes now you see it came up with that little windows thing and it says getting a few things ready it do its microsoft thing it takes a minute so let it do its thing nice and quick once it's done now we've got fast internet this can take up to 10 minutes to um about if you've got fast internet it'll take about 10 minutes if you've got more slow internet it could take four hours or something like that Personally, I have quite good internet, so it will be quite quick. And but I will speed it up so you don't have to watch the tedious process of it downloading. So it's going to get a few things ready. And all we want to do, instead of, we don't want to upgrade this PC, because as you can see, I'm already running Windows 10. We want to create installation media for USB flash drive, DVD, ISO file. So we just want to leave all this as it is, this should be set perfectly for the system that you are doing. Just hit next and make sure you choose USB flash drive, then hit next. So now you can see for me it's come up saying we can't find a USB flash drive because I last used my flash drive on Mac. So all I need to do is go to disk man. So if it doesn't show up with a flash drive for you, go to disk man. Scroll down until you see your flash drive, it'll most probably be like one of the bottom ones. See, it's a removable. All you have to do is right click, new simple volume, next, 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 finish. To spin around, and there you go, so now I've got my flash drive. Now all I need to do is hit refresh list, it's found my flash drive, and just hit next. Now to get a few things ready, it's going to start the download, and it's going to create the installation media on this USB flash drive. And I will time lapse this for you starting now. Still, seven minutes later from the beginning of this video. Well, for me, it was seven minutes for you, it must have been about five minutes. Your USB flash button is ready. Now, we need to do is hit finish. It will take 
maybe one five minutes to go, depending on what your system is. Then just load it up. And you can see this is my flash drive here, and you can see they're set up. Just as one is admin. And all you need to do is just go to the Windows 10 setup. Personally, you should restart your computer and go into your boot menu to um, post, as in um, like boot from USB. It for your computer it might be a SCAFE, it might be S2, it might be S8, it might be F9, it might be F10, it might be F11, it might be F12, and it might be delete. It just depends on the system you have. Can figure it out and let me know in the comments below. I will more than happy help because I don't get any comments so I can easily reply. Thank you guys for watching. If you if this video was helpful, then make sure you hit that like button and press that subscribe button and also leave a comment as it boosts my video in the algorithm so let's see this so we can help other people. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video and if you need anything, as I said, let me know in the comments below. Thank you and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!